my dear brethren i greet you all in the miraculous name of our savior lord jesus christ the topic for our today's morning manna is effects of backsliding when you backslide your family may also backslide and be put to a lot of suffering when abraham went aside to egypt sarah got into trouble and she was taken to pharaoh's palace pharaoh entreated abraham well for her sake now abraham is being honored by the world it is crystal clear from this that the way to get the admiration and honor of this world is to deny christ or compromise with the world it is not to criticize anyone but some churches sometimes compromise with the world so that the church organization can get the help of the world's government if you see the book of genesis 12th chapter 17th verse and the lord plagued pharaoh and his house with great plagues because of sarai abram's wife some imagine that it is good to compromise with worldlings it will do them good we can win them for christ they say you don't do any good by compromise in fact you bring a great plague upon egypt when god's people are not faithful god has to plague the world or send trouble to the world in order to get them out it was because of his mercy that god permitted some trouble in egypt to drive god's people out just as jonah was thrown out of the ship because of the storm for the plan of god concerning him to be fulfilled we learn a lot from abraham's backsliding in the same manner if we go to egypt which is resembling the backslide in our trials both we and our dear ones will have more trials and others will also suffer unnecessarily abraham finally escaped from egypt by the immense mercy of god we may come out of our backsliding however the effects of our backsliding can be eternal it is said that abraham got his egyptian wife hagar from egypt through her was born ishmael who became a perpetual enemy of israel besides although abraham escaped his nephew lot was not completely delivered from egypt having tested egypt he retained egypt in his heart dear children of god in the same manner while we may be able to come back from our backslidden state those who were affected or influenced by us may not come back at all so we should not become a reason for others backsliding lives may god give his grace to all of us to become a spiritual blessing for others god bless you all amen Lord make me willing to do your sweet will so all you